Hey guys, this is Kamigano, and today I'm doing a topic on will Marvel ever want to have MJ and Peter together? So mostly this this uh, this video is going to focus on the Amazing Spider-Man issue one. I feel like if we talk about that as a whole one more day, Nick Spencer's run and all that, uh, we'll be here forever. So I, I kind of want to focus on the, the, the main event, which is Amazing Spider-Man issue one. And the reason I wanted to do this topic is because we get to see a lot of changes in this, in this, uh, in this issue between MJ and Peter. Uh, in the last run, we got to see them in a, in a really good spot. You know, Nick Spencer's run really built that to be like, oh, maybe they'll even get together. Maybe they'll even get engaged. Maybe one more day will be reverted. And then that never really happens. And you're like, Oh, why didn't that they had that happen? That felt like it was being built up there and in your child, you know, just pretty much being teased a lot. And so in the last arc, you, you know, Peter is kind of unconscious for most of it. So I uh, we we don't really get to see them interact that much. But when you did, there are some really great moments between MJ and Peter. And I think MJ as a character as a whole was really great. And now here we get the six month uh, gap where MJ has children and we don't know who these children are. Now it's only been six months, so I don't think she's given birth in between there, but my guess is maybe these kids are like an alternate universe version of like Peter and, and MJ's kids. We obviously have many of those. Uh, we have Mayday, we have the um, anime, you know, we have a lot of those type of characters, uh, but then you have this new love interest, it seems like. It, it's not confirmed that's a love interest, it just kind of looks that way, the way it's been uh, shaped. Maybe we're being teased here, but, um, or, or uh, yeah, I would say teased, but so we get to see this man, uh, and you're like, oh, is this like her her new boyfriend? Is this who the kids are? But then the kids have red hair, and it kind of looks like Peter and MJ. So it's like, who are these kids? And and obviously, like, why did they break up? And and that's kind of my big thing is like, I like that there's a cliffhanger here and a, like a big moment I've never seen before. Like, this is definitely a story that hasn't been explored. But when you take a step back, it's exactly the story that's been ex explored every single run where you get a little teased and you're like, oh, cool, they're going to get back together. Or, oh, no, they're really not going to get back together. And, uh, you know, the whiplash of their relationship is what's been so hard because just you want them to be together even if they don't erase one more day at this point it's just like let them be happy so it's just like why can't we get that arc that it's just I don't love the rotation of the story of like keep teasing us and like say oh we want MJ we want Peter and then never really give it and and just only go one step and then take three steps back so do you feel like this arc is going to break them up again. Do you think that's Peter's kids? Or, uh, yeah, where do you think this is gonna go? Do you think we're finally gonna get to see MJ and Peter together? I don't. I really think that, I mean, we've been doing this dance for over a decade, so I don't think it's gonna happen, but I am curious to see, will they at least get back together? I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm very curious about this. I, I, I don't hate it. I don't hate this ending. I just hope it's going somewhere. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you thought. This is Comic Uno, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.